Hello guys, how are you? Welcome to the channel. Thanks for tuning in. So today we're having the top five fastest cars in the last five updates series. So uh, meaning we're going to have the last five fastest cars from the update 26 all the way to update 31. We are going to begin with the 1987 Mercedes Benz AMG Hammer Coupe and then we're going to get to the latest which is the update 31 car, the C8 Covert. All right, so let's get into it. All of these cars have an engine swap, which is actually the fastest available to each car. So let's get onto it and see which one of them is truly the fastest. All right. And I have to turn on the traction just to give all of them a better uh, launch and acceleration because some are really, really bad with its handling and they all coming in no particular order except for the fact that we started from the oldest to the newest who just had to lose a lot of power over there to get it right and this here just might be the fastest mercedes in the game well fully tuned of course can we see one more yep a 443 kilometers per hour on the hammer coupe and by the way, this is coming with a, a racing 7.2 liter V8 engine. This is crazy, guys. This is really crazy. So share your thoughts in the um, comment section and let us know what you think. And if you're interested in um, knowing the, the tunes that I, I, I had on this one here, let me know and I will drop it as well. So let's go on to the next car. Okay, so we've got the 1991 GMC Cyclone. And this car actually came with the Typhoon and the velociraptor all of those um, cars i made videos on them just in case just in case you still want to revise yourself on how good these cars were um i will be linking you in the description and probably uh leaving a card on top here for you guys to go check them out and if you're interested in the customization videos on all of these cars as well i will let you um have them in the description and probably on top of the card as well so this year is coming with a 6.5 liter V12 engine, fully upgraded and tuned. Let's see what we're going to get on it. If it will be able to beat the Hammer Coupe. All right, I'm trying so hard to get the, the, the acceleration right over there by the corner. And uh, we just, come on. 18, 19, 20. Okay, so we had 420 kilometers per hour on the 91 Cyclone from GMC. And I believe you guys have actually seen the actual performance that I got on um, the cars on the side of the screen. You, you should check them out as well. So this is it for the Cyclone. I believe it was the fastest car um, amongst the cars that got released in that update. So yeah, let's go on to the next one. So over here, we've got a 2013 Toyota GT86. Uh, it came out in the, uh, the 26 with the Lexus ISF and the Lexus RCF. Uh, let's see what we're going to get on this. Coming with a 2JZ engine. Well, of course. JDM boys, are you there? Okay. We are into it. And guys, honestly, there's a lot going wrong with this car. No matter what you do. You just cannot get it right with the balance. It's just so bad with the handling. I might need to stay more focused over here. No matter what, no matter what you do, you're just gonna find yourself bumping, bumping onto the wall. But you do not write it off. It really, really is fast. Forty-two. And I believe that's just about a 442 kilometers per hour. Aside the fact that it really is undrivable, I really do not see how anybody would want to put in um, or swap in a 2JZ engine just to get the fastest out of this car here and still be able to maintain its handling. Like it really, really is. It's hard. It really is hard, guys. So uh, we got. 442 kilometers per hour on the Toyota GT86. I, aside everything, I genuinely love how it looks. Really, gives me uh, a reminisce of the BRZ 
So let's get on to the, the next car. And this here is our 2020 <laughs> Koenigsegg Jesko. Fully upgraded into it as well. And a little is, is, is needed to be said about this car here because there was a lot of hype uh, when it was getting released in, uh, in the update 30. A lot of people like to this moment just kind of get enough of this car. So let's see what we're going to get on this. So this one here isn't uh, squat tuned because if you squat tune it, you will be getting a lot out of it. And it just wouldn't be drivable like the other ones. So I kept it normal and basic and already getting 400 on the third gear. Uh, this is crazy. Uh, this is crazy. A Ford 60, 70, 77, 80, come on, 84. So, 484 kilometers per hour on the 2020 Koenigsegg Jesko. So, if you didn't know, this car is undoubtedly or unarguably the second fastest car in the game. Yeah, tuned, of course. Yeah, it's just behind the um, Ferrari 599SX and if you squat tune it, um, probability of you getting 500 km per hour is still there but it requires a lot of pre precision driving and making sure you're getting all of the corners and everything near perfect before you can get past the 500. So this is it for the Jesco, let's get on to the final car which is the update 31 Corvette C8. So this here is our last car, the Chevrolet Corvette C8 and of the 31 car is the, the recent um, car that got released like nearly a week ago and yet again if you haven't seen all of the customization videos of all of these cars guys I will be linking you in the description possibly on top of the cars for you guys to go check them out just go check them out and share your thoughts on them as well all right so let's get into it this is coming with a 6.5 later v12 engine packing a lot of power of course uh, let's see what we're gonna get on this but one thing for sure is i love this car it's handling is exceptionally good regardless how fast it goes and all that you just it just gives you the ability to control it without stress or hassle so we got 436 i really do not think we're gonna get more and that's just about it for the COVID C8 uh, yet again this car is still new so like if you give yourself more time playing with it you just might be getting a lot more out of it because you can see that it's still got a lot of potential to do more actually so this is it for me guys uh, these cars are really really fast these cars are really really fast the coupe is just untouchable the, sorry, the AMG Hammer Coupe is just untouchable. We've got the 2 Jay-Z2 killing it. Then, <laughs> the Jesco is just untouchable, of course. We've got the Covet C8 doing 436, which is really, really good. And lastly, the Cyclone. Alright, so, this is it from me. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to leave a thumbs up and make sure to click on any of the videos that you currently see on the screens and you do not go anywhere. I will catch you over there. Yeah, until then, every single one of you should stay safe. Peace.